Hello guys, this is Indian Medico and in this video, we are going to see about sulfonylureas. This is a concise presentation for medical students. Sulfonylureas are anti-diabetic drugs. There are three generations of sulfonylureas. The first generation sulfonylureas include chlorpropamide, tolbutamide and tolazamide. The second generation sulfonamides include gliburide and glipicide. The third generation sulfonyl ureas include glimipride. Now let us see about the mechanism of action of sulfonyl ureas. Sulfonyl ureas act by three ways. They stimulate insulin release from pancreas through inhibition of a potassium channel on beta cells of islets of Langerhans. They increase insulin action on target tissues by prolonging binding of insulin to target tissue receptors. They reduce serum glucagon levels through indirect inhibition. This is because increased insulin level inhibits glucagon secretion. These three things will reduce serum glucose levels. Now let us see about the uses of sulfonylureas. Sulfonylureas are used in non-insulin dependent type 2 diabetes mellitus. Now let us see about the side effects of sulfonylureas. Hypoglycemia, skin rash, allergic reaction, and disulfiram like reaction with alcohol are the various adverse drug reactions of sulfonylureas. Disulfiram like reaction with alcohol occurs especially with chlorpropamide. Now let us see about the contraindications for the use of sulfonylureas. Sulfonylureas are contraindicated in pregnancy. This is because these drugs cross placenta and they will lead to insulin depletion in fetal pancreas. Sulfonylureas should be used with caution in patients with renal or hepatic insufficiency. This is because these drugs are excreted via liver and kidney. If you have any suggestions, please let me know in the comment section. For more such videos, please check out my pharmacology playlist. If you like my videos, kindly subscribe. Your subscription will encourage me to make more videos. Thank you.